As a non-Indigenous person, I've had the opportunity to work with many Indigenous leaders over the last 15 years as mental health, mental wellness has come onto the national stage. My observation is that in many, in many cases, Indigenous leaders um, have greater knowledge than do the non-Indigenous leaders. And my point that I continue to make is that I urge our non-Indigenous leaders to listen to our Indigenous leaders as listeners, not just uh, as watching tokens speak. And I want to urge our Indigenous leaders, our, particularly our research and mental wellness leaders, to continue to insist that their voice be heard, even in areas where they have been rejected up to now. And I look to the youth and the youthful knowledge makers to ensure that one of the things that they concentrate on is their responsibility to be leaders, to insist on being heard, and to take, when you are heard, to take the proper message forward that will continue to advance the needs of our people.